Welcome back to the Cyber Power Tech Lab. Today we're going to take a look at a product that we first introduced back at CES 2014 earlier this year. This is our Fang Battle Box. And this is a small form factor machine that we've designed specifically for LAN party use. Uh, you can use it obviously for other things as well, but primar the primary use is for LAN parties. And there's a couple of reasons why that's the case. Uh, the first is obviously this handle that is on top of it. So you can see that I can pick the system up very easily with this very sturdy handle and have no worries about it breaking. The other is this latch on the front here that allows you to open the lid very easily and access the internal components. And that's a little more important for some other reasons that I'll get to a little bit later. Uh, so let's look at a couple of the design features of the outside of the case first. And you'll see that the front uses our FANG design language. When the system is powered on, the Cyber Power logo here lights up. Uh, it has a red line accent all around the outside of it. On this front panel, obviously, besides the handle on the latch, there are two USB 3.0 ports, the power button and the reset button. Uh, there's nothing on this side because we've designed it specifically so there's nothing on that side. This is the back side. Uh, it also serves as the bottom if you want to orient it in this position. So you can do either way. It just fits a more diverse range of like desktop situations. And then on the rear panel, we'll call it, we have the I.O. ports. There's the power, uh, the, the AC power in. There's obviously the graphic card output and then the motherboard I.O. This is a mini ITX motherboard like, compatible, so a lot of the mini ITX motherboards have really cool features like built-in uh, wireless AC, uh, AC Wi-Fi, so you have wireless internet and just a bunch of really good features. So now we will go ahead and open the case and talk about some of the internals. So this is the inside of the Fang Battle Box and you'll see that there's actually an internal frame and then it's wrapped in like this box. And that would normally present some thermal challenges but we've combated those by inserting these plastic baffles to compartmentalize the heat and then by strategically placing fans and vents we expel that heat from the chassis and it's actually even more efficient than it would be otherwise. So very good cooling characteristics in this chassis. Um, as far as the fans and everything go, there's a 120 millimeter fan mount here in the back as well as this uh, 120 or 140 here on this bracket on the top and then an additional 120 right here in the front. And it, uh, it can, you can use a liquid cooler on a CPU. This particular system here actually is equipped with the AMD Radeon R9 295X2 graphics card so we're using uh, one of the available radiator spots for this card and the reason we can't also liquid cool the CPU in this system is because this card is so long. If you had a traditional length card like a more a normal length card like a an R9 290 or even a, a GTX 780 or 780 Ti what you could do is get a product like the uh, NZXT Kraken G10 uh, liquid cooling adapter thing and you would then be able to liquid cool both the graphics card and the CPU because you'd have this extra room in the back of the case. So it's got a lot of different cooling options despite how small it is. Uh, it has obviously the micro ITX motherboard is kind of straight down here. Uh, I would angle it up but you, you get the idea it's right there. The graphics card is mounted here. Um, the power supply goes here and one of the really cool features about this and what makes this case really cool for LAN parties is that it has this easy swap module right here where you can have two different hard drives that plug in and out of this compartment so you can just easily swap out a drive so you could have games on one and you could have like your work stuff on the other so you could actually use the system at home for work and have like a hard drive with all your business documents and stuff and then when you want to go to a LAN party just pull that drive right out and put in your drive that has like your entire Steam library on there and so that's pretty cool um, other than that, there's not much else about this case on the inside. Uh, it's all very tightly kind of put together so that we save all the space we can, but at the same time, remember, it's got a really good cooling characteristics. 
So uh, that's the thing, Battle Box, and we've gotten a lot of uh, interesting press about this thing so far. Uh, a lot of the companies that saw it at CES 2014 really thought it was a really cool looking case, or maybe a little bit over the top. But and, uh, one thing is definitely true, uh, this is an exciting new product for us and you can definitely check out more about it on our website www.cyberpowerpc.com. See you next time, that's Cyber Power Tech Lab.